against the backdrop of escalating Russian NATO military tensions Russia's Ministry of Defense has equipped yet another one of its Darugush GI-class corvettes with the Navy's latest anti-submarine anti-torpedo system in preparation for the Baltic Fleet's November military exercise. The vessel Boyki is the third corvette to be commissioned as part of Russia's latest Starogush GI-class series. It is preceded by Starogush GI and Subrazitelna I and is one of 13 Starogush GI-class vessels to be commissioned through 2021. It is not particularly surprising that Russia would start replacing its aging 1970s Grisha-class ships. What should raise concern among Western observers is the speed with which these new vessels are being armed with Russia's formidable Packet ENK anti-submarine anti-torpedo system. Packet is a naval weapon consisting of an integrated central control system a hydroacoustic station for sonar target detection. and a launcher equipped with anti-submarine MTT torpedoes as well as heat-seeking M15 anti-torpedoes. Pockets MTT torpedoes and M15 anti-torpedoes are similar in size can be varied in quantity before each deployment. Russia Agency of Defense Exports Rasabiran Export claims that warships equipped with such systems have their anti-torpedo defense effectiveness augmented. Though their comparison baseline is unclear also unclear is how much the entire system costs to produce. But Rasabiran Export's apparent willingness to sell packet by its individual components may give them additional leverage in export negotiations. Packet offers drastic range and targeting improvements over the old Soviet RBU anti-submarine rocket launcher system. But its long-term advantage lies in its modularity. That is packets constituent parts are designed to be individually upgradable without any overarching alterations. It is aptly named in that packet is Russian for bundle. 